Good morning everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 13. It's just turned 8 o'clock and we've been up for about half an hour. Neil's actually got the next two days off work, so today's Thursday. So he's got Thursday and Friday off just because he had a holiday to take. I mean, he can't take it the week before Christmas, as in like Monday onwards. Um, because why, I don't know why he couldn't take it he put in his holiday form like in January last year and they said no I think it's because he had it off so many years consecutively so we've got technically Neil's got a four day weekend and I've got two days because I'm working Saturday and Sunday um, I took yesterday off filming just because I needed to plan out my week I do it all the time when it comes to vlogmas when I like do so many daily vlogs consecutively and then I don't schedule in time for my pre-recorded videos so I took time out yesterday to plan the rest of my month and my upload schedule so I can get all my pre-recorded footage in just because I spent October and November filming and planning and editing and getting them all ready and I just haven't put them live so I needed to take yesterday off so I could put a video up and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this weekend off. This doesn't matter, but I thought I'd let you know. I'm going to take this weekend off, so Saturday and Sunday off, double. I, I don't think I've ever not filmed, like, twice in a row. Um, but I'm going to do pretty much the same thing I did at the weekend, just gone. So you don't really need to see that again, because obviously I'm working. So then you'll have two pre-records back to back film for a couple of days and then do another two pre-records back to back and then it'll be sort of countdown three or four days to Christmas. So other than that yesterday we had a home day, I did some baking with P, I'll show you those in a bit and just had a really good day. It's been, I don't know, sometimes her moods I really struggle with and sometimes she'll wake up like the devil and it's just a really big struggle and then other days she's a pleasure to be around so past couple of days we've had really good days which has been great so yeah we had another home day yesterday got on top of chores just so I don't have to worry about it too much whilst Neil's off work and yeah Pete and Neil are currently sat on the sofa underneath our duvet they're watching Netflix we got Netflix free trial um just so I can watch a couple of Christmas films and stuff and we wanted to watch The Sinner we started watching Sinner 2 and Neil fell asleep so we turned that off Last night we watched Wonder, that's on there, we saw that cinema this time last year. And they're now watching Babe, which she's loving. She doesn't like the coughing sheep, because there's a coughing sheep in there as well, so she relates that to when she went to Rocks and Barnes the other day, which is so funny. But if you've got any Netflix series recommendations, leave them below. We like sort of like crime, drama stuff, like Luther and Line of Duty and... What were the other ones that I liked? I can't remember. But that's what we like. And then I like, I still need to finish off Gossip Girl. I think that's going to be one of my things to do. Once P's in nursery and I get to have some time to myself, I'm going to try and finish Gossip Girl. I can't even remember where I got up to. I think I got up to series three, I think. I can't remember. Spoilers if you haven't watched Gossip Girl. I definitely remember... Blair being pregnant to that guy the prince I think I honestly can't remember I don't know who Selena's was with but yeah I do I do love Gossip Girl anyway I'm gonna go I need to rest my voice because I've got a really sore throat make some breakfast I really fancy toast I weighed myself on Monday and I've gained two pounds, but I can tell that my period's due. I can just tell I'm so hungry all the time. I'm not pregnant, definitely not pregnant. I'm not trying for a baby and I don't want one anytime soon. Um, but yeah, I'm just starving and I've been in a right bowel mood. So I'm waiting for that. But yeah, I gained two pounds, so I just thought, you know what, fuck it. I'm not going to weigh myself for the rest of the like the two Mondays that I've got in December. I'm just going to eat all the mince pies and enjoy it. And then start again in January with a fresh slate, because 
scales and weighing myself is just it's not nice um i think i might do a separate video about that actually on my channel we'll see we'll see if that's something you're interested in I, I've, I've said to charlie from mummy in the know i wanted to do a follow-up she did a I can't remember what it was called, but it was like, why quitting my diet was the best thing I've ever done or something like that. And that was really, really good. So I want to sit down and sort of do a response video to that. I do sort of brush on it in the video I did with Ellie on Sunny World, but... Right, I'm going to go. This is, again, what happens. I haven't spoken to my camera for 24 hours and I filmed six minutes. It's quarter past ten and we are all ready. I can't be bothered to do my hair today So this is how I did it when I woke up and this is how it's gonna stay We are off to go to Horsey Gap today Which I'm not gonna lie. I really can't be bothered to do because it's gonna be so cold um, but We haven't um, hang on let me just put you on a book We haven't done anything too exciting with P recently um, so we're going to go there and it's basically this beach where seals live and go and like give birth to baby seals. I don't know. Jesus, look at the, um, my makeup is not looking fresh. It's a good job I'm wearing, um, a scarf today. Tell you what, I'm going to go put that on now. Head there for a couple of hours. Oh. Neil's now going up into the attic to get some welly boots out for me. Doing. For God's sake! Bye. Bye. Yeah. No, don't now. Go up there because she'll see the Christmas present. That's right. Nothing's up here anyway. She's definitely going to see her Christmas present up there because it's not the box. Your games? Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, so bad. What else can you see? See your scarf on see my hat. Oh. Be careful, Daddy. I'm being careful. Mrs. What? You left something in the loft. What have I left? Something Christmassy. What? The polar bear. Yes. I don't want the polar bear. Well. Pardon? Oh my, my boy went that my my birthday. By by what for your birthday? The day. Dad. Yeah. By by my my by my house of my birthday. Yeah, who's is this one? Evie's one. We're keeping Evie's one here, aren't we? Mm -hmm. And by one on my birthday. Would you like one? One. You want a yellow one? Well, that's awkward. <laughs> oh, you need a poo. Oh, for God's sake, of course you need a poo. I don't want to no it. way, I can't get her down. Oh, right, I'm getting down. I've been in the car in the car park for 35 minutes because P fell asleep. So I enjoyed the peace and quiet. Here she is. Do you have a little sleep? Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Yeah? We've now come to Horsey Gap to come and look oh, at the nice. seals. Mm -hmm. Excited? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna go for a little walk.
right, it's a lot less breezy down here now. I'm aware I look like an absolute helmet, but it's cold. There was um, a little seal pup up in the sandbanks. Neil thought it had died, but it wasn't dead. But there was one on the beach that I filmed, I zoomed in, where it had died. And I said to Neil, I don't think seals eat seals. So if not, there'd be more blood on the beach. So I'm not too sure what's happened, but I don't know why I like the seal people. I don't know what they're called, but there's like wardens. I don't know if they're allowed to go on the beach and clear it up or get rid of it, but there's like seagulls all around it, like eating it. It's so grim. I've never seen like a dead seal before. It was awful. Okay, I'm gonna go. I also had a wee in a bush because I almost wet myself, so that was fun and cold. Did a little food shop. Spent twenty pounds. Hey, I'm not the tiger. Those <laughs> tea bags. Three o'clock ish. We've come home, we've unpacked the shopping, went to a couple of charity shops and there wasn't anything there. And we are now sitting down to do our puzzle this year. Some of my lights on, some of my lights on the Christmas tree died so this is my new set i also have my old set on there and they don't work so i don't like the tree without the extra lights so can you fix it for me no. you fixed it last year do you know what you did you literally just took them off and put your vault stick on it and it worked you don't have your vault stick do you um so we're now sitting down to do our puzzle i've got some tea and our biscuits that i made yesterday i'm gonna quickly show you these look Mm, they smell good. Yeah, in a minute. Have you trumped? No. You stink. Mm -hmm. So this is the little setup. Where's your? These are the edge pieces. This is a thousand piece. We've done two five hundred pieces already, and you're doing really good puzzle bits, aren't you? Oh, we can do it. Yes, you can. You've done loads. Well done. Look at this fluffy tummy. So this is the update on the puzz. 
we've done the border. It's nearly done. Uh, probably about 30 minutes left, 20 minutes. they do their play? Yeah. Um, so yeah, I've done some bits under, out underneath Rue. <laughs> These bits. <laughs> and I've laid all this out. Laid all this out. Got extra pieces in here and in here. And we're watching Nativity. Are you? Not really. Look at Whirly for Christ's sake. She's like, where's my dins? She would generally eat off the table, wouldn't she? If we put like her, if we put her dinner there, if we if we put some chicken there, she'd eat it. Oh, yeah. Me, oh, brother, just let watch Whirly. <laughs> Told you. I told you! I'm so full after that dinner. It's now about six o'clock. I am just trying to find my phone, which is in here. And I'm going to listen to my podcast, which is Loose Lips by Louisa Zisman and Anna Williamson. They are my favourites and they just talk. Hang on, this I can't do this. I'm going to come back for the other one. Um, they just talk about mum life and how you can't speak or do or say anything yeah. in this day and age anymore. It's really funny. So I'm going to listen to their podcast while I do all of this washing up. Always builds up when Neil's here. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm going to do that. Neil's going to give Pete a bath and then put her in bed. So I need to have a shower tonight, wash my hair, ready for a lavender tomorrow. I don't need to reply to my Instagram comments and WhatsApp messages. Oh, right. Let's watch out. <laughs> oh, I don't know at the bottom. Wally Wells, what are you doing? Uh, nothing, Mum. You put it on. <laughs> I'll just casually put on P's vest onto Rue just to see if it would fit, and it does. Are you age two to three in Primark, Wells? Come here, Whirly. Put clothes on Whirly. Do you remember? I put Rue in a baby grow once. She loves it, doesn't she? Yeah, she Keeping her warm. What is it, Mr. Men? Show tinsel. Say thank you. Okay. Hi, my this day is Hannah. What? It's the Welcome back to my channel. Mm -hmm. Is that what you're saying? Uh huh. Mummy Pig and chocolate egg. Pig and chocolate egg for Christmas. Uh huh. And then he brought for Christmas his house. Right, come on. <laughs> Let's read your story. It's not amazing. <laughs> you ready? Right. Now you and I know that Christmas is in the winter in December, the 25th of December to um. be exact. Do you know where we're going tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Where? We're going to see Aladdin tomorrow! Yay! He is now in bed 
and I'm actually going to end off the vlog here just because I've got quite a bit to do tonight and there's some telly I want to watch and obviously I'm not going to get up to anything else other than editing so um, I also need to wash my hair and stuff so even though it's early I can crack on with my edit and then do everything else that I need to do Neil's going to go on um, the playstation for a bit I'm going to go, I hope you all enjoyed today's vlog and I shall see you all in the morning, bye